There are 40 or 50 languages in California that have no speakers anymore. We decided on this Breath of Life workshop, the Conference of California Indians, to talk about what is going on with their languages and what they want to happen for their languages. We have among the best collections of California Indian language materials in the world. We invite California Indians to come learn how to access their language, learn what uh, documents exist on their languages in our archives, in our libraries, and so on, how to use those materials to make language lessons for others or to just uh, study and learn the language oneself. Breath of life is exactly that. It's the breath of life. The living words that you carry in your heart that you want to express through native views, through native feelings, cannot be expressed in alternate languages. When you kill a culture or a language, you kill a world view that might teach you something. Now this word is the word for day. Do his, do his. I can say from my own experience, I have learned a great deal more from the Indians than I ever thought I would about how to face life. This is for the future of my people so that the kids that are coming forth and the generations to come that they'll have something to fall back on and hopefully this would give them a good foundation so that they can be proud of who they are. And it's spiritual and it's our ancestors talking to this generation saying now is the time before it gets lost. What's it mean? I used to fight. Ah. <laughs> I feel more Miwok than I've ever felt in my whole life.